All right, in this video, we're gonna be going over the Vituvia, the Utivia, the Extivia, whatever you wanna call it, V-T-U-V-I-A, S-N-100. Fat tire, e-bike, hunting bike, whatever you wanna call that. There's a couple different sayings on the website of what it is and let's unwrap pop that open looks like uh unstrap that unclip it probably the easiest way to take the bike out that's what i usually like to do if you've seen my last video it was a little bit of a struggle to get the other one out so but I'll unclip the tire, take the tire off first, take some of this packaging out, and then we'll pull it out. All right, got the bike out, tire. Last thing that came in the box, a little accessory box. Time to take all this packaging off. Got all the packaging off. And take this off, put the hand, handlebars on. Then we can start adjusting how high and low we want it after we get the wheel on. And look at that. Headlight right inside the frame. One last step. Handlebars on, display on. Then we need to take this battery off so we can charge it while we do the rest of the tire and that's about it. It's a tire. Oh, pedals. Tires, pedals, and back seat. Then we gotta adjust everything. But I've noticed we don't got a back rack. There's the mounting holes for it, but it's not already on. I'm gonna take a look at the website, see if it's a mistake or if that's just how it's supposed to come. All right, now next up. Easy on, easy off. And then, looks like we're missing a bar, so we'll charge that up. Pause. Ready? Yep. Yeah. All right. Open the accessory box. User manual. Got our pedals labeled left and right. Little toolkit. Quick release for the front tire. Finishing the charger. I get a plug in really easily. All right, did a little more adjusting since we got the tire on. This whole thing came up pretty high, a lot more higher than I thought. Lifted this, twisted these, adjusted the thumb throttle because it was too high. This seems like it's going to be a little off with the brakes don't really give that much of an option. Adjusted the screen. Got the seat on. Now pedals. And then we gotta put some air in the tires and uh, give it a give it a quick go. Battery should be done charging after that. One thing I want to point out is when you're doing a lot of the installing Always, like when you're doing handlebars, you don't have to tighten it all the way because you're gonna adjust it later once you actually get the bike where on level with the tire. But with the pedals, you can always tighten it as tight as you can. You don't want them coming off when you're pedaling. So always put your pressure on. And this battery goes on through the side, so you just get it on that little lip right there. And just press it on. 
Alright, time to turn it on. Let's see, got the power button right up here. Beautiful color screen. Looks like we could have charged it a little bit more, but I'm still gonna take it out. I can always do this little test too. It's on pedal says zero. Let's bump it up to one. Thumb throttle. Hydraulic brakes. Seems like they need some fine tuning. Taking it out now. Before we take it out. You gotta fill these Kenda tires up max at 30, looks like, PSI. So let's give it about 28-ish. Tires inflated, everything adjusted. Brakes might need a little more tightening, but yeah, that we'll do a later time. Time to turn it on and take it out. The Tuvia, the Vituvia, Yituvia, Vituvia. Somebody will correct me how to pronounce it right. Yituvia, the SN100 hydraulic brakes. Let's go. Need to redo these wires too. They came all jacked up. Hang off the side. Yeah, pedal assist or the throttle capped out at 23 miles per hour. And there it is. If you like this video, found it helpful putting it together or just taking it out of the box and actually looking at it before you buy it. 
please give it a thumbs up. Get my channel subscribed for more unboxing of more electric bikes. Until next time, peace.